So the next assumption is that they most likely twincest. Twincest. <laughs> I'm Rebecca and we are the Art R Twins. If you're new here, smash the subscribe button down below and hit the notification bell because we post two videos every single week. My voice is completely gone. So you sound like me and I sound like you. So before we get started with this video, I want you guys to comment down below where I got this hair from. If you get it right, we might be the next shout out of the day in the next video. What are we doing? What are we doing? So in this video, we asked you guys on Instagram, on Twitter, through Skype, on Pinterest, through P.O. Box, everywhere we could get to you guys. Comment down below. Assumptions about twins. Some assumptions were a little bit, <laughs> little bit risque. So we're gonna get to it. Trifling. Trifling. Good for nothing type assumptions. So let's get started. <clears throat> Assumptions number one, I assume you have completely different personalities and get on each other's nerves all the time. No, we no, don't. no. We actually have very similar personalities. The only difference is that I'm more outgoing and I'm more business need. A and you're like, you're more like a dreamer. Yeah, I'm a dreamer and I'm mm. like, optimism, positivity, no negative thoughts. We can dream big and get millions and millions and you know. And, and I'm like, I'm a realist, and yeah. I'm, so I'm like, okay, so let's try to try to do this. Like, that's not gonna work. That's, mm, and, but like, oh my god, just believe, believe. And like, yes. And also, I'm definitely more of a risk taker. You are. I'm, I'm very. Not a risk taker. I'm ballsy. Mm -hmm. That's it. You can say that. Okay, good. I don't even <laughs> risk to getting a different meal. <laughs> we don't get each other. We don't get each other's nerves. Yeah. Next assumption. What is it like not having the exact same life as twins? Marriage, etc. That's a great question. I like that because obviously as you guys know, Rachel's married mm -hmm. and I'm single, like completely single. She put, put the sing in single and wanted a bundle ring on my finger. I would say it's, it doesn't really phase us, but people do ask me all the time, what is your marriage? When you having kids? Because of the fact that she's married with kids and I am very focused on business. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> and I'm a workaholic, I admit it. She's a workaholic. And if, workaholic. if Becca wants to get married and have kids, like honestly, like she can get a guy to get married and have kids. Yeah. But I do think about sometimes like, I wonder how Becca feels like and not having like, a family. Seeing a different dynamic. It inspires me more yeah. to want that. Not that I really like, I'm, I'm not really motivated still to like pursue it. Not, I'm just but you're a lot of, closer. But I'm like, okay, maybe if it happens, I'll be okay with it. Oh. So, good I'm taking steps, steps, steps. These steps. are some good questions. Yeah. Oh, before we get started with the next one, mm -hmm. we have to get a glass of wine going. Cheers. Girl. Always. Okay, let's pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. Okay. Mm. So, the next assumption is twins can't stay away from each other for too long. We did. We long. did. We were separated for like what five years? Five years, and we barely talked to each other. When we first separated, I was devastated. She cried. I boo hoo 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 cried, but like as we were kind of moving on in life, we got comfortable being our by ourselves. Right. So we saw each other what like once a month, and then we're like we'll talk here and there, but it just like it's like talking to dad. Like it just you love them with all your heart, but then the days go by so fast, yeah. you're like, oh, how did three months go by without right. saying hi? And when I moved to Fort Lauderdale, it was like, okay, now we really that game never over. saw each other. Mm -hmm. And then, I remember, <laughs> I feel like Lucas right now. Oh, you are Lucas, remember? She was like, uh, hey Rebecca, I'm like, Rachel, I can't talk, I'm with the client. You're always with the client! Oh my gosh, I'm like, I'm tired like, of talking to you. She flipped out, like, you're always with the client, you never get out time for me. I was like, <laughs> One moment, please. Let me go talk to my twin sister. I'm like, you never call us. You never talk to me. You are so me. So yeah. So, but I'm honestly so happy that I'm here. Cause now you get to spend a lot of time with me and Lillian. Yeah. So it's so, nice. Does Lillian like, actually knows who you are? I, I remember Becky when you came for a birthday party. And she's like, do you know who the heck you like, are? You look at something bad. She goes, onto who? That you guys want to have twins so that they can experience the bond and connection that you two have. I did want twins. Rachel I did. did. I did. <laughs> I definitely did. No, I did. I really did because of our bond. 
I was like, oh my gosh, I can't wait to have twins to experience that. But yeah, I just saw my belly stretch from what you like, like, ah, that right there. I'm like, nah. My belly was big. It was big. But honestly, like, I hear stories about twins that don't get along. I'm like, dang, yeah. that sucks. That does suck. Because we were like, we're best friends. We were close. We are very close. Next assumption twins are loving and caring. You guys just proved me right. And I love your complicity. Keep it up. <laughs> yes. Yes, it's true. We're Just always good. up to no good. Except for 99% of the time, we're not. I know, right? <laughs> Y'all be doing the same thing even when you're apart without knowing. No. Like we're completely different people. Honestly, only because of our career. Our lifestyle. Yeah. That's the only thing. And since moving here, my lifestyle is like yours now. It's switching to mine. So I think it was just my environment. But yeah, me too. I can work. I'm yeah. So no, we actually, I'm a speech therapist. She's a business person. Like yeah. I'm introverted. She's extroverted. Uh, yeah. I'm like a mom. She's. What's funny? Well, you know, you're a mom to two dogs. <laughs> I am a mom. <laughs> that you two are super best friends and protective of each other. Facts. Facts. My no printer. My family would tell you. Don't mess with one twin if you don't want to mess with both twins. Like, we were just always a package deal. I, I feel like my voice is so gone. It's like, can you guys even hear me? They probably think you're mean. I'm you. Yeah. They do what you're mean. I'm you. No, and you do mind to get to the top. You, you can't get me no matter who you, you are. <laughs> Loser. Okay. A little who? The her. her. Okay. Our favorite movie. Fun fact. Comment down below what movies are first. Yeah, comment down below. This isn't an assumption, but y'all are very beautiful, and I love y'all's vibe and energy. Love y'all. Oh, yeah, love thank you. Too. you. I love you guys said this, so yeah, we appreciate, we appreciate it. all of them. My next assumption: you are not actually twins. We're gonna set the record straight because we're getting a lot of comments saying that, oh, you guys aren't really identical. Do you guys know what how twins are identical? Let me show you guys. So first, they are one egg, then they split. Then the sperm comes in, and, and then they're fertilized, right? right? And it's a big sack like this, right? And then and then it gets split into two eggs. That's identical twins. Fraternal twins is when they're two different eggs. Right. You put your egg up. Yeah. And then they both fertilize separate, and then they're fraternal. So our eggs are kind of. So like together. A lot of people are thinking like, oh my god, identical twins, what are they together? Guys, we do makeup different, hair different, yes. and like expressions different. Is different. So obviously like different lifestyles. Right. Like, so we're not gonna look exactly the same because we're still diff two different humans. Right. But that doesn't mean that we're not identical twins. And a lot of guys notice when we don't have makeup on, we obviously we look up we look way more similar. Very alike. We just do our makeup different. We just do our makeup, yeah. You can read each other's minds. Mm -hmm. But what am I thinking about right now? You're thinking about sleep. And what else? Food. Oh my god! I swear. You're thinking about food? <laughs> Baby, you're always thinking about food. I am. We actually made a video of twin telepathy. If you wanna look it up in our video playlist. Just binge all the videos. Yeah, just binge watch us. <laughs> but are our twins twin telepathy? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We'll put it in the description. So next assumption is that they most likely twin says. Twin cest? Like, is that like incest but with twins? Oh yeah, we do. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no. That's just like weird. That is weird. That they're jealous of each other. No. Never. Except for sleep. We don't get jealous of each other. Uh, we love each other. And uh, we always want the best for each other. Very much. Yeah. That it's difficult to tell twins apart, but even identical twins are identifiable in some unique way. Bingo. Yes. Bingo. So we could, we have a lot of differences. Yes. So Becca, like your her face is different than my face. Yes. I think now that we're living closer to like the way we are, are like getting more similar. Yeah. We're starting to look similar. Yeah, we're starting to look more alike because we are like we we're kind of like we hang out all the time now. Right. So more like it's like you know when a couple hang out too much, mm -hmm. they start looking alike. It's like that. Especially because I you know steal her clothes. Oh, yes, she does. And. Uh, her hair. So, that is my hair. And her lashes. Of, and my lashes. Everything. 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 <laughs> Horrible. Let me show you guys a picture real quick. So this morning, Rachel did her hair, right? Mm-hmm. And let me tell you, this little girl was, she was feeling, feeling herself, that. boy. Oh my God. Look at this. <laughs> she was in the marriage straight feeling herself. She was in the, wait, I got it. Look at that. <laughs> Just straight feeling herself, like, 
She literally was giving herself kissy faces. I was like, what are you doing? <laughs> it was just too funny, <laughs> too funny. Next assumption is twins are different from each other. I would say in the most part, yeah. I think anyone could be different from anyone based on their environment. That's also, if you're similar and different, it's yeah. weird. My assumption is that even if you guys are in separate states, you guys can feel if the other person is going through something, like twin intuition. I like to say it's true. I would love to say it's true, but it's not. I don't <laughs> That you guys can tell when the others is guilty, even if you don't know what they're guilty of. My discernment spirit can tell up with a lot of people in general, mm -hmm, but yeah. not, it's, it doesn't necessarily be a big issue twin, but yeah, it's not like do anything bad though. Girl, yeah, you do. Like what? That one thing? What thing? <laughs> <laughs> you guilty. You ain't gonna put me out on camera, is you? <laughs> I'm just joking. <laughs> that person gonna comment down below, what is it? What is, what is it? That's it. Right, so, yep, that's all the assumptions we have for today. We posted it super last minute. We did. It was so, super last minute. Like I'm literally sorry. an hour ago. So, if you didn't get a chance to post your assumptions, I'm sorry. We are literally procrastinators. So, <laughs> <laughs> my bad. That is it for today's video. We really hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share. Bye. What a freaky twin thing. What a freaky twin thing.